What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to our living room. We're the Octobers. We're back with another Marvel Monday for you. We're checking out Captain America 2011 today. It was directed by Joe Johnston. Babe, have you seen this? I have not, man, but I'm really excited to watch it because all these movies have been really good so far. So I'm assuming this is probably gonna be an origin story because it's the first time we're getting a look at Captain America. With that being said, I don't really know too much that I can add because no, I don't know much about it. No, but I do know, know like on the title, the second part was the first Avenger. I don't really know what that Duh. means. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I have no idea. So you guys know, man, we are gonna check out every single Marvel movie in order that the way you guys told us to. So it's gonna be a long ride, man. We got a long ways to go, but if you guys wanna get early access, if y'all don't really like to wait, because I'm kinda like that myself, man, y'all can go join us on Patreon, guys. For only $5 a month, you can get all the YouTube content that we're gonna do. Guys, also for $10, we have the ticket holder pass. So on YouTube, we're gonna stick to movies, but over on Patreon, guys, we're doing TV shows and just series like that. We also recorded Seinfeld for the first time today. I've never seen it, but I thought it was absolutely hilarious. So, so funny and so, so nostalgic. He's nostalgic for her. I've never seen it. Let's not talk too much. Let's go get into some Captain America. You the guys from Washington? You get many other visitors out here? How long have you been on site? Since this morning. It's really not that surprising. This landscape's changing all the time. Oh, we don't have the equipment for a job like this. How long before we can start craning it out? Is a UFO? I have no idea. I don't know what that is. Brave. That's all I can say. Hey, where at? What is it? Careful. Give me a line to the colonel. I don't care what time it is. This one's waited long enough. So they already know something about him. <laughs> Sounds like war times. Something obviously meant something. Open it! Quickly before he gets. It's taken me a long time to find this place. Command it. Help him up. The dad on Hacksaw. Was that him? Mm -hmm. What others see as superstition, you and I know to be a science. Tesseract was the jewel of Odin's treasure room. Odin, Thor. The Tesseract, is it? Uh-huh. I cannot help you. Must have some friends out there, some some little grandchildren, perhaps. No need for them to die. Egdrasil, tree of the world, guardian of wisdom. He just knows everything about this He's place. He's a genius, dude. I would not. I would not have known that. Oh, God. That's the real one, isn't it? Yeah, that one glows different. Oh, yeah. You have never seen this, have you? It's not for the eyes of ordinary men. Fool! You cannot control the power you hold. You already have. Why is he touching his face like that? Henry. So the whole time that he was in the war in Hacksaw Ridge when he had PTSD, basically he that's what he was doing the whole time. What did your father die of? Mustard gas. I was hoping I could be assigned. Your mother? She was a nurse in a TB ward. Sorry, son. Look, just give me a chance. You'll be ineligible on your asthma alone in your life. Cue the Rocky music, because he's got a long ways to go. <laughs> continues to ravage Europe, but help is on the way. Every able-bodied young man is lining up to serve his country. Even little Timmy is doing his part. <laughs> Collecting scrap metal. <laughs> Play the movie already. Hey, you want to show some respect? Hey, just start the cartoon. Hey, you want to shut up? <laughs> any threat, no matter the size. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. <laughs> I like that little Easter egg. <laughs> you just don't know when to give up. I can do this all day. 
<laughs> hey, pick on somebody your own size. Dang, he works on that combo. <laughs> You like getting punched. I had him on the ropes. How many times is this? Oh, you're from Paramus now. You know it's illegal to lie on the enlistment form. You get your orders? 107th. Sergeant James Barnes, shipping out for England the first thing tomorrow. I should be going. Come on, man. Well, last night. Gotta get you cleaned up. Future. The Stark Expo. His dad's expo? You know, there's three and a half million women here. Well, I'd settle for just one. Hey, Becky. What'd you tell her about? <laughs> Only the good stuff. Welcome, Welcome to the Modern Marvels Pavilion and the world of tomorrow. Better world. That place is dope. Um. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Howard Stark. He was a lot younger. Did he look that young in the first film? <laughs> I don't remember. No, I think he was older. What if I told you that in just a few short years, your automobile with stark ravitic reversion technology you'll be able to do just that you got to take the wheels off every time <laughs> i did say a few years tonight <laughs> that's a good start he's just like tony isn't he they're mm. the same <laughs> that's funny <laughs> Come on, you're kind of missing the point of a double date. We're taking the girls dancing. You go ahead, I'll catch up. You really gonna do this again? Well, it's a fair. I'm gonna try my luck. As who, Steve from Ohio? If they'll catch you, of course, they'll actually take you. I know it's a war. You why why are you so keen to fight? There's so many important jobs. What do you want me to do? Collect scrap? Yes. yes! I got no right to do any less than them. That's what you don't understand. This isn't about me. Yes, we are. Don't do anything stupid until I get back. How can I? Taking all the stupid with you. <laughs> He's not the one getting punched up in that alleyway. Careful. How did they know each other? Did they say? I don't think yet. Don't win the war till I get there. I'm guessing they're brothers because his dad was in the 107th Infantry and he walked up and said 107th Infantry. Like, I guess it was important to both of them. But it hasn't said yet, I don't think. Who's this oddly procured your fellow? Someone who wants to know him, I guess. Wait here, is there a problem? <laughs> <laughs> Just so happens to read that. <laughs> Thank you. Man, snitching. So, you want to go overseas, see some nuts? Dr. Abraham Erskine. Steve Rogers. Where are you from? Queens, 73rd Street, and Utopia Parkway. Five exams in five different cities. That might not be the right file. No, it's not the exam. <laughs> it's the five tries. Do you want to kill Nazis? Is this a test? Yes. I don't want to kill anyone. I don't like bullies. I don't care where they're from. There are already so many big men fighting this war. Maybe what we need now is a little guy. I can offer you a chance. Only a He has a chip on his shoulder. Good. So where is the little guy from? Brooklyn. Congratulations. He trusted him too easy. Way too easy. Not suspicious at all. I feel like you should say meanwhile. <laughs> you know what I mean? Are you ready, Dr. Zola? Machine requires the most delicate calibration. Forgive me if I seem overcautious. Are you certain that those conductors of yours... This artifact, I am certain of nothing. <laughs> That's the same one Loki got, right? Was the... Yeah. But he knows he can't touch it, I'm assuming. Sixty. I have not come all this way for safety, Doctor. What a cliche thing to do. I know. I must congratulate you, Arnim. Though they may require some... The exchange is stable. Missing. This will change the war. Wow, so they just got that energy. Yeah, on whose side though? And that's gonna power all this stuff. So they designed all these weapons without even being able to power it. So they designed them based on hypothetical possibilities. Seems like it. I guess it's a war, so they're experimenting, right? I supervise all operations for this division. What's with the accent, Queen Victoria? Gilmore Hodge, your majesty. Step forward, Hodge. Because I got a few moves I know you'll like. <laughs> Colonel Phillips. I can see that you are breaking in the candidates. That's good. <laughs> For that dirt and stand on that line at attention until somebody comes tells you what to do. Yes, sir. General Pat has said we are going to win this war because we have the best men. 
<laughs> Troll. Strategic scientific reserve. It's an allied effort. Our goal is to create the best army in history. But every army starts with one man. He will be the first. Here's another movie with the super soldier. Mm -hmm. It's been all the way since World War II and we've been looking for one. Flat on the mud. May personally escort Adolf Hitler to the gates of hell. <laughs> the pace, let's go. Come on. Faster. Faster. <laughs> That's all you got. This army's in trouble. Nobody's got that flag in 17 years. <laughs> now fall back in the line. This is a Mulan moment right here. Get back in the formation. Rogers, I said fall in. Rosie about it. <laughs> Ooh. That could go either way, though. Thank you, sir. They could be like, I didn't tell you to do that. I said climb it. They didn't, maybe they didn't say. Yeah, they didn't say, but is this Simon Says or something? Sometimes people are, are smart. I wouldn't have known. God rest us so. When you brought a 90 pound asthmatic onto my army base, well, maybe he'd be useful to you like a gerbil. I never thought you'd pick him. Oh, pick a needle in that kid's arm, it's gonna go right through him. Come on, guys. <laughs> Look at that. He's making me cry. I am looking for qualities beyond the physical. Yes, I know. I am well aware of your efforts. Then throw me a bone. Hodge passed every test we gave him. Oh, he God. He obeys orders. He's a soldier. He's a bully. Win wars. Guts. Grenade! Oh, my God! Get away! Get back! What? You gotta grab that grenade and threw it. Yeah, I would have chucked it too. Is this a test? He's still skinny. <laughs> and he's like, that grenade would have blown him in one second and everyone would still be screwed. May I? Yeah. That guy kind of looks like he should be exploring like a lost temple. Can't sleep? Yeah. I got there. Can I ask you a question? Just one? Why me? I suppose that is the only question that matters. <laughs> right? This is from Ausberg. I said it. Well, many people forget that the first country the Nazis invaded was their own. Small. And then Hitler comes along with the marching and the big show and the flags. And the... And he, he hears of me, my work, and he finds me. And he says, you. Well, I am not interested. So he sends a head of high his research division. Now, Schmidt is a member of the innocent ambitious. He and Hitler share a passion. Hitler uses his fantasies to inspire his followers. He has become convinced that there is a great power hidden in the earth, left here by the waiting to be seized by a superior man. Schmidt must become that superior man. Did it make him stronger? Yeah, but there were other effects. The serum was not real, but more important, the man. The serum amplifies everything that is inside, so good becomes great. So that's why I needed him. This is why you were chosen. Because a strong man who has known power all his life, but a weak man was a value of strength. Thanks, I think. <laughs> that is kind of a bad kind of compliment. Yeah, thanks for calling me the weakest. Whatever happens tomorrow, you must promise me one thing, that you will stay who you are. Not a perfect soldier, but a good man. I'm gonna cry in this one. I'm already about to. <laughs> no, no, wait, wait, what I am doing? No, you have a procedure tomorrow. No fluids. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't have a procedure tomorrow. Because after I took it now. <laughs> <laughs> if I ever get an evil layer, I hope mine looks just like that. It's pretty nice. Yeah. <laughs> the statue found him. <gasps> you disapprove. I just don't see why you need to concern yourself. I can't imagine he'll succeed. Serum is the Allies' only defense against this power we now possess. If we take it away from them, then our victory is assured. So they're the German side? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but apparently that was one of Hitler's like highest men. ranking officers. Yeah. Yeah. But then he became obsessed with the idea of the Tesseract and then found it. And it made him stronger than ever. Mm -hmm. And he already has that serum. Bastard. No, all he's doing is like that. I know this neighborhood. I got beat up in that alley. <laughs> and that parking. Did you have something against running away? If you start running, they'll never let you stop. Get up, you push back. Can't say no forever, right? I guess I just don't know why you'd want to join the army if you were a beautiful dame. An agent, not a dame. You are beautiful. You have no idea how to talk to This is the longest conversation I've had with women aren't exactly lying enough to dance with the guy they might step on. <laughs> this way? What are we doing here? Follow me. Why does everyone look like they're like from Brooklyn ready to just like rob you? Yeah, or yeah. hit you with a pipe. Come on, get out of here. Yeah, get, 
I'm working here. <laughs> Wonderful weather this morning, isn't it? Yes, <laughs> but I always carry an umbrella. Oh, that oh, was a key a code. Word, yeah. I was like, it wasn't raining at all. The the Mazer pistol. You seen, you seen it? Yeah. They didn't have the grip though on it. They're synchronizing that thing. Overstaffed. They got two door guys. That would be so nerve wracking to be him though. Gotta have all these people watch you inject this serum. Mm -mm. Please, not now. You ready? Take off your shirt, your tie, and your hat. Senator Brad, glad you can make it. Oh, this is Clem. Uh... Craig Clemson, State Department. Please, somebody get that kid a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> They're probably wondering why did they pick this little shrimp? Comfortable? It's a little big. <laughs> See me any of that schnapps? Not as much as I should have. <laughs> the stock? How are your levels? Levels at 100%. Start. Agent Carter, don't you think it would be more comfortable in the booth? Oh, yes, yeah, of course. Good. Sorry. Do you hear me? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, today we take not another step towards annihilation. We begin with a series of micro injections into the subject's major muscle. The subject will be saturated with vital rays. Oh, God. That was penicillin. <laughs> Serum infusion. Beginning in five, three, one. Now, Mr. Stark. Vital signs are normal. That's fifty percent. Sixty. Maybe they should have put him to sleep. No, I can do this. Do what? Eighty hundred percent. They probably tried to do some stuff like this for real and killed some people. No, yeah. There's tons of experiments I heard. Mr. Stark. Why did he holler for Mr. Stark though? I guess he's in charge. Son of a bitch did it. We did it. Yeah, yeah. I think we did it. You actually did it. You look taller. How do you like Brooklyn now, Senator? I can think of some folks in Berlin who are about to get very nervous. So they're doing it for more propaganda, I guess? Either that or to win the war. I'm sure all of it goes hand in hand. Oh my god! Okay, so this guy should be able to stop him, right? Yeah, any shot. Oh my god. We're shooting grandmas on Marvel. What a shot. I know. Go girl. Didn't this man got Grand Theft Auto on him like that? Yeah, he doesn't even get to train with his like, with his like new body and stuff. Yeah. He just has to go straight to combat. What if that was a test? Yeah, he's a little clumsy. You can be strong, but if you were punching like he was punching in the alley. Imagine if he had his mics on, boy. <laughs> oh, I didn't think of that either. Go oh, see that door. He's gonna use that as a shield. Oh my god! You knew it. No, no. Did he get shot? No. Yep. Man, he just grabbed that kid and ran off right in the middle of the city. No, no. He's about it for real. Wait! Don't! Don't!
<laughs> oh no. Oh, not the, the escape <laughs> submarine. Oh boy. You better know how to swim. You better not go looking for the Titanic. Too soon. Well, those guys are stupid for that. <laughs> yeah, what if he can just grab that by the wings and just be like, no. Nope. Oh, yes, drown him. <laughs> well, he thought he was good as soon as he was in that submarine. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. What if he needed that one? First off, many. Got off one head. Two more. Oh, he's dead. Why is he foaming at the mouth, babe? Because he just killed himself. You didn't see him? He popped a poison cap behind his tooth. Oh, that was that that was what that was? Yeah, people used to do that, bro. Yeah, I've seen that in these movies. I've never seen it before. You serve at his pleasure. He gave it his facility as a reward for your injuries. You think this is about appearance? Your hydro division has failed. <laughs> the Führer feels, how does he put it? The red skull has been indulged long enough. Gentlemen, you have come to see the results of our work. Let me show you. Hitler speaks of a thousand year Reich, but he cannot feed his armies for a month. His troops spill their blood across every field in Europe. He's bad mouthing Hitler. <laughs> Science, but I understand. <laughs> Great power has always baffled primitive men. <laughs> Wherever they are, regardless of how many forces they possess, all in a matter of hours. I have harnessed the power of the gods. <clears throat> right, right, right. <laughs> Berlin is on this map. So it is. <laughs> So it is. You will be punished for your insolence. You will be brought before the Führer himself! Dang, so he's going rogue for real. He's not on either side. You better dodge that machine. I gotta pluck a cable out. My apologies, Doctor, but we both knew Hydra could grow no further in Hitler's shadow. Hey, two fisting. Yeah. <laughs> Hail Hydra! Oh. He said, that's right. That's what you better say, sir. He's like, damn, I didn't sign up for this. Any hope of reproducing the program is locked in your genetic code. He deserved more than this. If it could work only once, he'd be proud it was you. Well, speaking modestly, I'm the best mechanical engineer in this country. But I don't know what's inside this thing or how it works. I'm on a number of committees, Colonel. Hydra is the Nazi deep science division. Hydra's practically a cult. They worship Schmidt. I think he's in this. As of today, the SSR is being retasked. Colonel? We are taking the fight to Hydra. If you're going after Schmidt, I want in. You're an experiment. You're going to Alamogordo. You are not enough. Mm. So well, all that for what? The enlistment lines have been around the block since your picture hit the newsstands. Heidemann Lab. Son. Sir, that's all I have. And congratulations. You just got promoted. You're just getting everything easy. But who's that guy? Bonds by bullets. Bullets kill Nazis. Bing, bang, boom. You're an American hero. <laughs> if you're getting there. Senator's got a lot of pull up on the hill. Play ball with us. You'll be leaning your... <laughs> Look at his little uniform. Barrel of your best guy's gun. <laughs> America, carry the black gun. This is for weapon like sales. Yeah, just making money, yeah. Uh, Trades of money. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> the song. Bullets and bandages, tanks and tanks. Keep our boys armed and ready. Oh, okay. I was about to be like, what the heck? <laughs> <laughs> He's an actor now? Basically, yeah. <laughs> He's just becoming an icon. He's basically like Uncle Sam. I, get I guess it. you're getting him really famous. I mean, maybe they need something like that, mm -hmm. like for like morale. But why would they do that whole serum thing and waste all that money? I'm not really sure. <laughs> they could have just picked anybody to do that. I guess it's the uniform. How many of you are ready to help me sock old Adolf on the job? <laughs> <laughs> no, like, it's not funny, bro. Uh, I need a volunteer. I already volunteered. 
<laughs> Tough crowd. <laughs> I think they only know the one song, but um. <laughs> Do that, sweetheart. <laughs> it's Tinker Bell. Come on, guys. We're all on the same team here. Don't worry, pal. No warm up. Don't worry. Look at his boots. Hello, Steve. Hi. Hi. What are you doing? Officially, I'm not here at all. I had to improvise a little bit. Crowds I'm used to are usually more, uh... <laughs> sales take a 10% bump in every state I visit. Is that Senator Brandt I hear? Phillips would have had me stuck in a lab. A lab rat or a dancing monkey. You were meant for more than this, you know? I know. Why wouldn't they make him a super soldier? So they only did that just for propaganda. That's what you were saying earlier? Yeah, that's what it seemed like. Okay. It seemed like, we have these soldiers. Don't come over here, you mm -hmm. know? Front lines, serving my country. Finally got everything I wanted. And I'm wearing tight. Look like they've been through hell. Schmidt sent out a force to his army. 200 men went up against him, less than 50 returned. The rest were killed or captured. The 107? What? Oh, that's his friend or yeah. brother. If it isn't the Star Spangled Man with a plan, <laughs> you don't get to give me orders, son. I just need one name Sergeant James Barnes from the 107th. I have signed more of these condolence letters today than I would care to count. I'm sorry. Well, you better check, Gramps. I oh. know. The name sounds familiar. Are you planning a rescue mission? Yeah, it's called winning the war. But if you know where they are, why not at least... They're 30 send... miles behind the lines. Through some of the most heavily fortified territory in Europe. I think I understand just fine. Well, then understand it somewhere else. <laughs> Directly, you got some place to be in 30 minutes. Yeah, I'm gonna be behind that line. I do. Oh, so he's about to go single this thing out? If you have something to say, right now is a perfect time to keep it to yourself. <laughs> what do you plan to do? Walk to Austria? That's what it takes. You heard the colonel. Your friend is most likely dead. Steve! He brought the shield. <laughs> told me you thought I was meant for more than this. Every word. And you gotta let me go. I can do more than that. One stage, girls. Five minutes. She going with him? I don't know, but they, she should have handed him a gun. Oh, she gave him a helmet. The hydro camp is in cross. Just get me as close as you can. You know, you two are gonna be in a lot of trouble. They will undoubtedly shoot back. Well, let's hope it's good for something. Stark is the best civilian pilot I've ever seen. He's mad enough to brave this airspace. We're lucky to have him. This is your transponder. Activate it when you're ready, and the signal will lead us straight to you. Are you sure this thing works? Get back here! We're taking you all the way in! Give me orders! The hell I can't! I'm a captain! <laughs> <laughs> True. Y'all gave him the name. What if he got shot? And that was the end. Like, what if it was just like... I wouldn't have pulled my parachute that early. You're just floating there. Increase output by 60% and see to it our other facilities do the same. And use up what strength they have left, Doctor. There are always more workers. What if that's like the raw version of that thing Tony Stark created? Well, it was either that. So you know how computers used to be smaller and we're making them smaller as technology mm -hmm. grows? Either that or he's up in the scale. Like he's building it bigger than Tony Stark did. Yeah, but I think Tony Stark built it from scratch. They got it from Odin. I don't know. One of these days, I'm going to have a stick of my own. <laughs> you hope so what is he just like a brilliant fighter and strong he doesn't really have anything else than that besides He's, the shield yeah, super strong i guess super agile maybe just has like great great soldier instincts or something he just jumps in there with them they're about to get thrown out look <laughs> See the dent in it. <laughs> That's the first generation one, isn't it? <laughs> They're just like, yes. <laughs> I know. Who's Hang there? On a <laughs> Wait, who the hell knocks on one of those doors? <laughs> they got on the forklift just saw him, didn't he? I don't know, maybe he has tunnel vision on that forklift. Who are you supposed to be? I'm Captain America. Very <laughs> <I> go, pardon? <laughs> no, what the heck? <laughs> sure. Is there anybody else? 
I'm looking for a Sergeant James Barnes. There's a nice selection more than the factory. That was jacked up. <laughs> you know what you're doing? Yeah. I've knocked out Adolf Hitler over 200 times. Oh, he's talking about <laughs> in that play. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, that took me a minute. I was like, what? He hasn't been training? You know how to use that thing? Okay. <laughs> it's happening. I feel like that guy's gonna turn on that guy. I feel like they have so many people, somebody else should be watching the cameras, alerting him. <laughs> Other than just him, the main people that German. need Bruce to be through. Whatever. Girls <laughs> and ask the no wonder he hated the war. Oh, he's like, there he is. This is his first look at him. <laughs> Our forces are outmatched. What's up with all this hand-to-hand -hand combat? Shoot his <laughs> No, he remember he said he didn't want to kill anybody. He just don't like bullies. No, I'm not talking about Captain America. I'm saying shoot Captain America. <laughs> one person shooting the front, one person shooting the back. You can't block both. I know, it's like 6,000 versus one. No, he has that army with him a little bit. <sighs> All you gotta do is just slap that little guy. Oh, he's about to get tricked, isn't he? Three, two, five, five, six, seven, five. Bucky. Oh my God. He found him in that big place. He's lucky. Wow. Steve, come on. Steve. Yeah, he doesn't know anything that happened. He probably thinks he he's thinks tripping. He thinks he's out of it, yeah. <laughs> come on. I joined the army. Wait, how long have I been out, bro? <laughs> He made that decision to blow all that up without hesitation. It's a lot of infrastructure. All he had to do was see that guy and he said, you know what? Put the code in. Captain America, how exciting. <laughs> I'm a great fan of your film. Oh, Dr. Askin Man. <laughs> You've got no idea. <gasps> He's <That> freaking. <laughs> Whose side are you on? You're supposed to be on this side. What a shot. The eye was his greatest success. Ugh. That took way too long. You don't have one of those, do you? You are deluded, Captain. Who is this dude? Tends to be a Red Skull. Unlike you, I embrace proudly. And how come you're running? What do you and think? Wearing a mask. What do you think it's? Um, Red Skull or Oscar Skull? Well, they said they're straightforward, so that's what I'm assuming. Oh, they're straightforward? Yeah, all the villains. They said most of them are pretty straightforward. Um. What about me? Whoever likes it. Not a scratch, Doctor. <laughs> Nasal spray. <laughs> <laughs> Voldemort. Voldemort? What's that? The guy we got for your partner. What's that thing gonna do? Drive straight up the whole time? What the hell? <laughs> no, don't keep going. That suck to not even know yourself. Are you gonna make it? Yeah, <laughs> I guess he did. Senator Brandt, I regret to report that Captain Stephen G. Rogers went missing behind enemy lines on the. I uh, must declare Captain Rogers killed in action. Period. The last surveillance flight is back. No sign of activity. Go get a cup of coffee, Corporal. <laughs> I can't touch Stark. He's rich, and he's the Army's number one weapons contractor. You are neither one. Don't you think I give a damn about your opinions? <laughs> Well, I hope that's a big comfort to you when they shut this division down. What the hell's going on out there? Oh, the boys are back. 107th boy. They back and they better. They got the they got them weapons, look. 
You know who'd have been really good to go in there and get them out? The Hulk. He mm -hmm. could have just went in there and just smashed everyone. Oh, they reloaded, boy. Oh, they got the enemy's guns. Mm-hmm. The thing is, what about the ammo for them? I don't know. Hopefully they brought some. It's unlimited ammo, right? If there's like Tesseract weapons. I don't know how that works. Some of these men need medical attention. I'd like to surrender myself for disciplinary action. <laughs> <laughs> that won't be necessary. Yes, sir. He got that goof goof helmet on. <laughs> You're late. Couldn't call my ride. Hey! Let's hear it for Captain America! He's like, finally. I'm finally a captain. How I always wanted to be. Is he still in tights and boots, though? This medal for valor to my personal friend, Captain America. Captain, that's your cue. I thought Sin. he'd be taller. Oh, there he is, right there. He said, I thought he'd be taller. <laughs> we love those guys. It's like the funnest thing to look for for some reason. Yeah. I'm be really bummed when we can't anymore. Here in Poland, right near the Baltic, here, 30, 40 miles west of the Maginot Line. These are the weapon factories we know of. Sergeant Barnes said that Hydra shipped all the parts to another facility that isn't on this map. We are going to set a fire under Johann Schmidt's ass. Yes, sir. I'll need a team. We're already putting together the best men. So let's get this straight. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Rather fun, actually. <laughs> We're in. <laughs> Hell, I'll always fight. But you gotta do one thing for him. Open a tab. <laughs> That's it. Well, that was easy. <laughs> How about you? Ready to follow Captain America into the jaws of death? Hell no. Following him. But you're keeping the outfit, right? <laughs> you know what? It's kind of growing on me. Captain. Agent Carter. Man. Howard has some equipment for you to try. Tomorrow Please be a new suit. I see your top squad is prepping for duty. I might, even when this is all over. Go dancing. And what are we waiting for? The right partner. <laughs> His own phrase. Yes, ma'am. I'll be there. I'm, I'm turning into you. This is like a horrible dream. <laughs> She's got a friend. <laughs> Trolled. Usual. Alpha, beta, or a neutral. I doubt Rogers picked up on that. Hard to see what all the fuss is about. Them Starks and them explosions, boy. Write that down. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm looking for Mr. Stark. He's in with Colonel Phillips. Of course, you're welcome to wait. I uh, read about what you did. Well, that's you know, just doing what needed to be done. Really, it's not a big deal. Uh, I don't think they were all married. You're a hero. The women of America and uh, seeing as they're dead. Of course, she's going to walk up on that. <laughs> I mean, that's on him. He could have been like, nah, chick. Captain. Agent Carter, wait. Looks like finding a partner wasn't that hard after all. I don't think anything, Captain. Not one thing. Well, what about you and Stark? How do I know you two haven't been fond doing? You still don't know a bloody thing about women. I didn't think, nor should you, pal. The moment you think you know what's going on in a woman's Oh, head. he literally wanted some cheese and bread? I concentrate on work. Who says that? <laughs> Carbon polymer could withstand your average German bayonet. I hear you're uh, kind of attached. Handier than you might think. This one's fun. What about this one? No, no, that's just a prototype. What's it made of? Vibranium. Stronger than steel and a third the weight. That's just an atom smasher stand, bro. Vibration. It's not a shield. Remember in the first Iron Man? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the level. Quite finished, Mr. Stark. Well, the captain has some unfinished business. What do you think? What if it didn't work? She's mad about that girl. Yes. I think it works. That's a sign, brother. You in the doghouse, my boy. I had some ideas about the uniform. I meant wrong. <laughs> Stay oh. away from her. <laughs> They're not even together yet. Look at his friend. <laughs> Poor brother, I don't know. Yeah, let us know, guys. Well, his name's Barnes and his last name's Rogers, so I guess they're just friends. They're just friends, friends yeah. And his name's Schmidt. Well, the uniform looks a little more tactical. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> that was crazy. Like, great job. 
<laughs> of course she saw that. <laughs> he did that on purpose. Because he knew he was in trouble. What a huge excessive tank. <laughs> Continually delayed because you cannot out with a simpleton with a shield. This is hardly my <laughs> a simpleton. simpleton. <laughs> I merely developed the weapons. I, I cannot fire. Sir, <laughs> we fought to the last man. Evidently not. I just want to say nothing to him. Yeah, he's scary. I just feel like jump up for sex. All right, Doctor Zola's on the train. Actually, it was kind of fun. Wherever he's going, they must need him back. I'm not saying I would do that, John. No, nope, definitely not. <laughs> but it'd be funner than falling down the cliff. Just calling because they're moving like the devil. With bugs on a windshield. Mind the gap. Better get moving, bugs. No shot. What a perfectly placed zip line. Mm -hmm. You guys are too skilled. Good job, America. Too quiet on there. Stop him. Fire again. Oh, his boy's about to die and he ain't gonna be able to do nothing about it. Oh my god, he's Fire. Teamwork. I'm on the ropes. I know you did. Oh, he used the same phrase he used. He had him on the rope. My boy. <laughs> yeah, whatever. My boy hanging on for real. He's had a tough go at it. Grab my hand. Oh my god. You're kidding me right now. Oh, your boy. Ooh. That's a tough way to go, too. The best friend's not supposed to die. Well, everything's going too good for him right now. Oh, they captured him. And I was like, what the heck? Mmm. <laughs> Cow. <laughs> <laughs> Don't eat meat. It disagrees. Cyanide. Does that give you the rumbly tummy too? <laughs> Every Hydra agent that we've tried to take alive, you want to live. I bought you dinner. Given the valuable information he has provided, Dr. Zola is being remanded to Switzerland. Of course, it was encoded. You guys haven't broken those codes, have you? <laughs> <laughs> Gonna kill you anyway, Doc. Your liability is you or Schmidt. It's just the hand you've been dealt. Schmidt believes he walks in the footsteps of the gods. Mm. Only <laughs> <laughs> You do realize that's nuts, don't you? Sanity of the plan is of no cause. And why is that? Because he can do it. Talk everywhere. Everywhere. Would you listen to that thing? Mm, probably not. Well, it depends. Tomorrow, Hydra will stand master of the world, born to victory on the wings of the Valkyrie. If they shoot down one plane, hundreds more will rain fire upon them. Cut off one head, more shall take its place. Hydra. So what the heck are they, like worms? I don't know. I guess if I was like one of these evil dudes, I'd be falling them. I guess. What's his message? Because, like, world domination is just not a good enough motivation, is it? I'm not sure. Dr. Erskine said that this serum wouldn't just affect my muscles, it would affect my cells. I can't get drunk. Did you know that? Your metabolism burns four times faster than the average person. It wasn't your fault. Did you read the report? Yes. Then you know that's not true. You did everything you could. Did you believe in your friend? Then stop blaming yourself. Allow Bond's the dignity of his choice. I'm going after Schmidt. I'm not going to stop till all of Hydra's dead are captured. You won't be alone. Johann Schmidt belongs in a bug house. He thinks he's a god and he's willing to blow up half the world to prove it. Starting with the U.S. How much time we got? According to my new best friend, under 24 hours. So what are we supposed to do? It's not like we can just knock on the front door. Why not? That's exactly what we're going to do. Like, oh, well, that sounds good for you, dude. Yeah, you have, like... The four times the metabolism of a regular man. So, like, like when I throw my shield, it doesn't come back to me, bro. 
It just keeps going. I have to go get it. <laughs> and it misses a lot. And when I hit people with it, it really doesn't do much. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Mario Kart. <laughs> 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 Oh, the detonator. Mm. Oh, the shield goes on the front. That's what's up. That dude ran out almost like. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, he Man, got a boomerang got technology. Are they trapped in there? I just go under the fire. What's up? The shield. He must have planned on getting caught. Just shoot him. Why are they not shooting him? Arrogance may not be a uniquely American trait. <laughs> <laughs> to what even you can do, ask and tell you otherwise. He told me you were his. Resented my genius and tried to deny me what was rightfully mine. What made you so special? He wasn't done with the serum. <laughs> That's what he said. Yeah. I'm just a kid from Brooklyn. I can do this all day. <laughs> Fortunately, I am on a tight schedule. He kind of threw it pretty good too, though. Oh yeah, it's like ultimate frisbee. Yeah. <laughs> We're in. I don't play that or nothing, by the way. Yeah, no, that wasn't it. <laughs> Didn't touch it. They don't even look scared. Mm mm. Not seeing all them raise it by him, boy. <clears throat> they just dissolve. Right. Closes the door right in time. <laughs> of course they don't make it. <laughs> he gets on my nerves so bad. I can't wait to see him get blown up. I did not expect his face to come off. Me either. At all. Who knew he had a removable face? And why can't he just put it back on? Like, I don't want to see this. Bot one, two, three. <laughs> oh, how many is going to kick in the head that way? Oh, none. That plane, slow as hell. Boy. <laughs> I was about to say, you ain't catching that plane. <laughs> that's my go. Oh, oh, that's his own whip. car. Oh, that's going to make him mad, mad, mad. I would scratch it. I'd key it up. Me too. I draw an octopus in it. I draw a nose on it. You lost your nose. Come on, Boy, how you got your eyes open right now? <laughs> oh my God, this is not the time for that, kids. Go get him. Oh boy, how is that helping me? <laughs> <laughs> He's a no, it's not my turn. Can you just jump up there? They're at risk here. Oh my God. Ugh. She's just standing there staring at his <laughs> Get off the car. Yeah, you better make it go off the cliff. <laughs> They put their names on them things. Oh, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that for some reason. 
A knife? Remember they said earlier no one's gonna be trying to stab you? Mm-hmm. And now they are. Oh, well, it's on the radio. <laughs> Oh my God, Chicago's out. <gasps> oh my God. <laughs> they always hook so wide when they punch. Not New York. Oh my God. <laughs> was that the most violent thing we've seen in one of these movies? Oh my God, yes. I think the taking of the face off was too, oh boy. I've never seen something like that. These blue lasers are so scary. Like one slice and you're out. He had one thing missing from his. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Woo! I'd have locked that thing. Okay, at some point you gotta be like, okay, look, time out. <laughs> like, chill for one second. We just gotta fix this plane. There we go. Good thing it's shaped like a stingray. Yeah. You could have the power of the gods! See the future, Captain! He probably just made him more powerful. What in the? He's probably like, I had no idea. I meant, I did not mean to do that. Why are you over here touching it for? Oh my God. He shoots to another planet. Or does he die? What just happened? Don't touch that. Oh, don't touch that. Pick it up with your shield, like just scoop it. Dude, at some point, <gasps> oh my God, I just want to just drop Oh my earth. God. What if that landed in someone's drink like an ice cube? Maybe in someone's bowl. Anyone can get their hands on that. Yeah, I know, it's about to be. She's like, well, I'm not going to argue with you, Captain. Well, obviously he's going to live. Well, he is Charles Muntz, little thing, don't he? Charles Muntz. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to need a rain check on that dance. You don't got time for quirkiness, boy. A week next Saturday at the Stork Club. You got it. It's a clock on the dot. Don't you dare be late. You no, know, I still don't know how to dance. We'll have the band play something slow. That conversation would be so different if they were married. <laughs> yeah, but you have to sign the. Steve, Steve, Steve. He didn't die. I mean, this is his origin story. He can't die. What if he did? What if he just died and never came back? <laughs> I would be like, dude. They're like, yeah, well, we did have Captain America. We didn't like him. So we just killed him off in the first movie. Actually, the guy quit. He was doing Game of Thrones. I thought the thing was a UFO in the beginning. Still a UFO. Well, where did he land? In Canada? He was almost in New York City, right? I'm not he sure. He was headed to New York City? Leaving Germany? I'm not really sure, like... Oh, the war's over? To the captain. Oh, no. Did he really die? Sir. Oh, he's got a robot arm, too. <laughs> that's awesome, guys. I love that. And the energy signature stops here. Just keep looking. Isn't that crazy that that's Tony's dad? We're mm -hmm. just watching his dad in life. Oh, no. He did die. 
Well, now in the beginning of the movie, they were uncovering the wreckage of his plane. He's in the plane. They haven't recovered his body. They was recovering it. But she just put that on my own. Wait, like... I'm kind of confused. And in, in the opening scene in the movie, were they in present day or were they in the past? I think present day. So they found... So like they must 2011. Have... Okay, I think I get it. So I guess they recovered him. Hmm, Rizzo. Good morning. Where am I? You're in a recovery room in New York City. Where am I, really? I'm afraid I don't understand. The game. It's from May 1941. I know because I was there. Where am I? Captain Rogers. Who are you? What in the world? Is that a set? All agents, code 13. He's in modern times. So that's what I was thinking. I was thinking. So okay. they recovered him from that. So and they tried to trick him. Yeah. He's like, what in the. <laughs> All he has to do is put his uniform on and pay $20 a picture and he'll make it. I was wondering if we were going to see this dude. Good old Nick. Look, I'm sorry about that little show back there, but we thought it best to break it to you slowly. You've been asleep, Cap, for almost 70 years. Wow. That would suck. You gonna be okay? Oh, that means everyone who we knew is dead. Yeah, just... Probably, right? We're just old. I mean, yeah, for sure. 70 years. Oh, He had a date. With a mission, sir. I am trying to get me back in the world, trying to save it. Gentlemen, you're up. Should we have watched that? Is that a spoiler? I don't Yo, know. That ain't our fault, guys. Oh. Man. Okay, guys, so that was Captain America, and I really like that one because it kind of like went back to the 1940s and it kind of made like it relevant to now, which was cool to me. I thought, I thought like all the like old timiness of it was like really incredible. <laughs> it was a really good movie, seriously. I thought it was a really cool loop how they threw us back in the past. I was not expecting for him to come to the future. Admittedly, I was sitting there wondering to myself, like, how is he gonna get to current times? But right, I was too. And you know, if we were supposed to watch this in the other order, this one would have been the first one. That's, oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So this would have been the first one, which still doesn't make sense to me because you would have still thought Thor would be right. Because they talk so crazy in it. Yeah, that's what you're saying. Yeah, so I you think, no, if we watched it in the order of actually like on the timeline, this one would have been the first one. Yeah, it was a really cool movie, man. The twist in the end uh, that he was asleep for 70 years inside of that airplane was definitely shocking. But I was thinking to myself early in the movie because it did appear to be present day to me because of the military technology and stuff that we saw in the opening scenes. But I was thinking maybe that's why. Maybe he crashed in that thing somehow because that was the only way that I could possibly see a tie. But I was not expecting all yeah, that. Yeah, so that part's a little confusing. Dude, super awesome bad guy. The dude that played in Hacksaw Ridge. We just saw this guy the other day. Anyways, this movie was awesome. Thank you guys so much for the support. Yo, hit us up on Patreon, man. Like, subscribe. Come join the team over here because we're going to be back next Monday with another Marvel. See y'all on the next one. Peace.